LeBron James with the ball. We're starting to get a rhythm a little bit here. LeBron James, downtown, he hits it. What a three from the king. This helped me out again? For what reason? But we're down by 17, man. The only, now we're down by 22. The only way we have a chance to win is if I'm playing. We are letting Derek Whitehead, who is a 73 overall, get buckets on us. And he's got four points, and we're losing because it's Derek Whitehead. You got to be kidding me. You got... They really just sold that assist. This is what I'm talking about with this game. How? Run, Mark! Why is he not sprinting? Why is... I'm going faster than him, and I have Kendrick Nunn all over me. LeBron's jogging. He's jogging. And he's able to chase this down. Why are you going for a layup? I'm spamming the bu- I'm- I'm- I'm done. I'm done, dude. I'm done. I'm spamming for the ball. I was trying to set a screen for the longest time. And this man, Jeremy Grant, sat there in the corner and took a contested mid-range on like eight different dudes. How am I supposed to win with my teammates playing like this? How am I supposed to win? All right, before we hop into this video, there will be a card in the top um, right, I almost said left, in the top right, and a link in the description to my new series. I started a Washington Commanders franchise in Madden 23 pre-draft, so it's going to be my own little universe. But the first video performed great, so be sure you check that out if you haven't already, and subscribe if you're new. Anyways, let's get into this video. Cedric Lewis, his first game against the Portland Trail Blazers, had 51 points, 9 rebounds, 7 assists, and 2 steals. Not perfect shooting from 3, but a great game all around, and we are going to put those stats into Synergy 2K, our upgrading system, right now. And if you guys are new to Synergy 2K, this is just a program uh, you can download. Uh, you can find it on Reddit. I believe you have to pay for it. Uh, you can find this program, and it allows you to upgrade your character through my NBA, so you don't have to play my career. That's it's basically a my career alternative. So, um, as you know from last episode, we put in our stats from game one against the Bulls, the game I rage quit in. I put my stats for that game, but now we're going to put in my stats for the Portland Trail Blazers game. And before I upgrade them, I'm going to go over some of the, the features of this mode. So as you can see, the XP is at the bottom left along with my character. And if I go to inventory, you can see the badges. I don't know what this badge is. I have no idea what that is. I know blinders. So these are auto badges they give you when you create a character. You just have to pick your certain archetype. So I gave Cedric blinders on silver. Like I said, I have no clue what grace on the pressure is. So I just didn't give him anything. And these are badges you are able to buy. As you can see, passing actually bailout has to be above um, a 60, I think. But this is the upgrade system. Uh, your XP, your buy, 208 XP to upgrade my free throw, etc. So I'm going to put the stats in for this Blazers game. And we'll see how much XP we get. All right, here are the stats. This stat right here, the one, that's dunks. So I'm not able to put that in unless I'm in the game. That's the only way you can see how many dunks you had, I'm pretty sure. So I just put one. Obviously, I had more than one. Uh, plus, minus. I know this is um, your field goal attempts. There's your three um, point attempts. These are your free throw attempts. These are, this is your assist. These are my turnovers. These both are my rebounds, offensive rebound, defensive rebound. Uh, these two are my steals. Zero is the blocks. This is the dunks. This is the fouls. Plus, minus. And then the difficulty multiplier. Um, it says it's automatically a one. I put a two because we're above Hall of Fame. I don't know if that works, so I really don't know how that works. Uh, we did not get the win, so we won't check that off. So we'll hit accept. Uh, invalid plus minus. I don't know why it does that, but it is what it is. And as you can see, 51 points is what we had. And I have 29,000 XP from that game. I might have messed up the multiplier a bit then. But I mean, hey, I ain't gonna judge it. I think these are the badges I have. Man, I could have had these on my character already. These are the badges I have already. So I can't upgrade them because my shot three isn't an 80 yet. And my clutch shooter, uh, my mid, no, my three isn't a 90 yet. Okay. So let's add some more badges to our inventory. I'm going to add catch and shoot to my inventory. I'm going to buy that. I'm going to add claymore. And lastly, I'm going to have green machine we'll get claymore it's on silver catch and shoot 
We can upgrade to silver. I still don't know what this is. Uh, we'll keep that for now. And finally, let's upgrade our three-pointer a bit. It's at a 73. Let's get that up to an 80. Let's get that up to an 80. I'm going to apply those to my actual character, and then we'll hop into the next game. We are going up against the Los Angeles Lakers in this episode. Our LeBron is going to retire. I can't do nothing about that because of 2K. And finally, like my career, you are um, you get three, I think, trade trades each season. Even though none of them go through, you get three trades, three free agent suggestions. So that's how I'm going to apply this to this my NBA. So when free agent hits, I will get three players I'm allowed to negotiate a contract with. If they don't sign, they don't sign. That's how I use it. And I'm going to allow myself three trades. So the two positions we needed the most was power forward and small forward. And I did just that. We got Jeremy Grant away from the Jazz for our first round pick, Gordon Hayward and Bryce McGowan's, I think is how you say his name. And we pulled Lou Dort away from the Hornets for Zeke Naji and James Booknight. So without further ado, let's hop into this game against LeBron James and the Lakers. We are here in Charlotte, North Kakalaka, going up against LeBron James, AD, and the Los Angeles Lakers. David Aldridge, we don't care what you have to say. Darvin Ham looks like an egg. These are the starting lineups. It has me listed at the point guard. Uh, no, it has the shooting guards at the top of the starting lineups for some reason. That's weird. I've never seen that screen because my career doesn't have good presentation like this. It doesn't make much sense. But in Charlotte, I don't know. Is this our first home game? I don't know if we were at home against Portland. But we got the upgrades to Cedric Lewis. Time to see if they work. And Max Lewis, you know what? I got to take advantage of this matchup. This man's only a 73 overall. He's a rookie like me, but I'm the better rookie. So post fade to start off the game, and it's a brick. I don't know. LeBron's got me in the post. This cannot end well. Actually, it ended pretty decently. He just took it immediately. He could have bullied me all he wanted, but now I got LeBron on me. Lou Dort getting straight to the paint. Okay, he didn't do much with it. Jeremy Grant, let's see. A little pick and pop action with you. Jeremy Grant from downtown. Can he hit it? He does. Jeremy Grant for three. Oh, fast break. I only see Kendrick Nunn in the paint. Can I posterize him? Nope. I just go up with a layup. That's a bit disappointing. There we go. That's the first three of the game. You scared me there a little bit, 2K. And that's not going to... He... Wow. I thought he was going to pull that. He did not. He, Max Christie with the mid-range. And we're down by 11. They didn't have LeBron or AD in the game, guys. That You can't be doing that. LeBron had that on lock, bro. He knew exactly what I wanted to do. He knew exactly what I wanted to do. LaMelo. I'm pulling that. I'm pulling that floater. It's good. LeBron James with the ball. We're starting to get a rhythm a little bit here. LeBron James. Downtown. He hits it. What a three from the king. The Lamelo, you no, give it back, man. You're not going one on one with LeBron in the post. It's not happening. There you go. Those are the shots you should be taking. Got to kick it back, Lamelo. You gotta be Lamelo, man. You're supposed to be a passer. Good shot, Ludor. He is not passing this game. He's just not quick with it for some reason. He has. He's having a really off game right now. Cause that game against the Blazers, he was really dishing it back to me quick. They were good passes, but I don't know what's going on. With him, and I am getting cooked by LeBron, not going to lie. I'm going to sub down. We're down by seven. Bench, please don't sell. Please just don't sell. And they sold. Okay, still down by 11, man. They're going to have to play me a lot more if you want to mount and come back. They're subbing me out again? For what reason? But we're down by 17, man. The only Now we're down by 22. The only way we have a chance to win is if I'm playing. So I don't see the reason why you sub me out. Terry, do something with the ball. Kick it back. That's a bucket. That's a mid-range, though, isn't it? It is. We can score to end the quarter. And I'm going to do just... There is no way I missed that shot. On Kendrick Nunn? There is no way I missed that shot, 2K. We are letting Derek Whitehead, who is a 73 overall, get buckets on us. And he's got four points. And we're losing because it's Derek Whitehead. You gotta be kidding me. You got. They really just sold that assist. This is what I'm talking about with this game. Run, Mark! Why is he not sprinting? LeBron's jogging. He's jogging. And he's able to chase this down. Why are you going for a layup? And then LeBron's able to do that right by me. I can't get past 
their 73 overall starting shooting guard, Max Lewis. Like, seriously, man. LaMelo can't pass for some reason. He's just deciding this game, I don't want to pass any good balls. I don't want to pass. I'm spamming the ball. I'm, I'm, I'm done. I'm done, dude. I'm done. I'm spamming for the ball. I was trying to set a screen for the longest time. And this man, Jeremy Grant, sat there in the corner and took a contested mid-range on like eight different dudes. How am I supposed to win with my teammates playing like this? How am I supposed to win? And then he gets the rebound and gets blocked again. I'm done. I'm turning everyone's shot tendency on this team to zero. And they, they, they're they going to sub me out. They put in the, the trash roster. And watch me get subbed back in. Watch me get subbed back. They subbed me in with... In, I, dude. Just give me the ball, dude. We went on such a big run. How is AD faster than me is my question. I have 99 stamina and my stamina is down the, the drain. It doesn't make sense. I went on such a huge run to get the lead to this small. To a 7 point lead. Just for us to end up losing. So Why? I swear to God if you guys start fouling. Do not play the foul game. The game is over. The game is over. If they score, they bet. You better not even think about it. Don't even think about it. Don't even one second left. What am I supposed to do, man? What am I supposed to do with this roster? Look at this. I had 56 out of our 97 points on good efficiency. 15 out of 15 free. What more can I do? 12 points from LaMelo. Not seven. I can't do any more. I can't do any more. This dude, I traded for Jeremy Grant. This guy was useless. Absolutely useless. And for us, we would have... I can't express this enough. We could have won this game with the sat line of all of our teammates if whoever was guarding Derek Whitehead wasn't guarding him. I could have played all 48 minutes. Who? I need to know who was guarding this man. I need to know. Because it was either Kenrich Williams or it was Terry Rozier guarding him. Because they... Need to be cut immediately. If this man scores at least 12, we win the game. This is the 24 points in 12 minutes. That is unbelievable. AD got clamped. And we lose because someone on this awful team decided they didn't want to guard Derek Whitehead. It's the only reason why we lost. Un this team is unbelievable ass, man. I and I'm going to have to go through the whole season with them.